Hey everybody, it's Sean Cummings here at the Gourmet Grill for Buy for Less, and today I'm going to make some cauliflower soup that's actually served as an entree. It's one of my wife's deals. And what she does is put it over a little bit of orzo pasta, but we'll get the, it's really pretty simple, garlic, onions, chicken stock, and cauliflower. And then we pour it over that absolutely dynamite flavor. So stick with This is everything we're going to have to work with. Got some pasta, chicken stock, olive oil, garlic, onions. And I'm just going to do a bunch of chopping and cutting, and we'll be ready to go. And I'm going to get some boiling water on for that pasta. And first things first, we're going to get ourselves a little olive oil on the bottom of that, so it tastes some onions and garlic in there. Now we've got everything chopped here. What we're going to do is use these onions first, then add your garlic. And the reason you're adding your garlic second is it will burn otherwise. Cauliflower will come later. I got it. And you can hear those onions cooking. So we've got a rolling boil on our water. We've got our pasta in here. And you know the thing you got to do when you get your pasta in, stir it immediately. So pasta is stirred. Onions are still working. Get our garlic in here in a minute. We're going to get rolling all right. Just put the garlic in here. What I like to do is pull my garlic to the side like this and kind of get it inside the olive oil. But don't burn it. Nice and aromatic is what we're going for. Pasta's cooking real well. We got a few minutes on that. Put some flour in here. And what we got to do is get ourselves a little bit of chicken stock at this point. And we want to cover the cauliflower. We're just going to let this stuff boil. I'm going to add a little bit of fresh pepper to it, and that is it. If it was me, I'd add jalapeno. Okay, so I'm trying to figure out on a pasta just how long to cook it, and what I do is I take a little piece out. It's called to the tooth. You just get it as, as, as you like it. If it's got a little crisp to it, that's too much, but you just want it to cook all. I did grind a little bit of pepper. I want you to see how this works, and just... Throw some in there. Don't go crazy. About a half a teaspoon. You want this thing to have some flavor. Our pasta is now done. I'm just going to bring it over here and strain it real quick. You can follow me in. And we're just going to let that thing sit because I'm going to throw that soup right on top of it. Strain it out. Throw it into the deal. Sometimes I let this cool. Sometimes I don't. Throw a little bit of olive oil over it so it doesn't stick. Stir it around. It's all good. Or you can run out of cold water if you want to, but we're going to eat. Right, we're at a full rolling boil. I'm going to take some of this. Okay, and the way to, to serve this is we're just going to do, you got a little bowl of pasta right there, and we're going to put the soup over the top. And then we just do our soup. It's going to go right over the top. This is a mar. And for these and more recipes, buy for less, okay.com. you got to give this one a try. It's fabulous. Not a